This is a part two to my custom men at arms tutorial in Crusader Kings. Uh, this video will be answering a specific question from part one that a viewer had. A custom men at arms regiment like the test knights but similar also to the cataphracta that the Greek have. So specific culture regiments. There are multiple ways of getting your men at arms to be cultural specific. One of them would be through traditions. This is just one way. There is another that I know of that involves innovations. So it, you could have a cultural or regional innovation that allows you to get cavalry, like for example, elephant cavalry men at arms. I've combined the files from creating a culture tutorial, my tradition tutorial, and my men at arms tutorial. So that's why I already have a bunch of code here. I will post the links to the other tutorials in the description. I will be going through both options for how you can implement this. Uh, I will start with the traditions way first. I will leave a timestamp on the screen about now showing the innovation portion of the video. So going with the tradition route, uh, we can go straight to the 00 test underscore MAA types. So this is where we made our men alarms. If we go to the can recruit section, we uh, make a little space in here. And then we can type in valid underscore four underscore MAA underscore trigger. And then we can go curly brackets space space parameter equals unlock underscore test night. So this would be the name of your men alarms that you've created. So that would for this tutorial it is test nights, but whatever you have named it, it will be there. And then we move on to the test traditions page and then we go to in here we can go parameters and then we go unlock underscore test underscore nights equals yes and then we can go after that straight to the cultural traditions so in here and then we can go culture underscore parameter underscore unlock underscore test underscore knights colon and then can recruit square bracket get m a capital a so there's two capitals here capital m capital a and a capital g but that makes three but if we go to then brackets single speech uh, test underscore knights and then out of the brackets dot get name and then outside of the square bracket as and then another square bracket men underscore at arms so what this will do this might seem a bit intimidating or confusing this is essentially making it so that your when in game when hovering over your tradition and then hovering over the text for this you'll be able to see what the test knights do or what they are uh, get their stats without actually having to recruit them or look at the military screen. We are now done with the uh, men at arms tradition so we can launch the game and see how it looks. And then for the innovation side of things what we need to do is make a new folder inside the top culture folder call it innovations and then create a new file in there called 00 underscore test underscore innovations dot txt so inside of this file here, we want to create a new innovation. Uh, for me, I'm going to call it innovation underscore test underscore night because all I want it to do is unlock my min alarms. So equals curly brackets, then we'll call it group, culture group, military, culture error. So this is which error your t innovation can be discovered in. I'm just going to put it in tribal and then go icon uh, I'm gonna use a icon from the base game so I'm just gonna default to leadership underscore one and then I can go potential or equals and then has has cultural pillar and then heritage underscore test or whatever your culture name is then after that, what we want to go do now is unlock our men alarms, and then put in our name of our men alarms. So it's test underscore knights, and then flag equals global 
underscore M A A. So before I move on, I am going to quickly put in the file location for the image that I have declared. So I'm going to go at leadership underscore one and then its file location in the base game is gfx slash interface slash icons slash culture underscore innovations slash innovation you can go through and copy paste this from uh, where the where it is in the files but I'm just going to type it out underscore 01 dot tds alright so now we've got to move on to the next file here so that's going back to our men at arms and then in the can recruit portion we can go and type in has underscore innovation then equals innovation underscore test nights so that's the name of the innovation you gave on this last page here so with that done we need to go now to the dot yml file so we're going to make that so we can go and put that inside of this english file here so if we type in test underscore cultural innovations underscore l underscore english dot yml and go in here and then we can go l underscore english colon and then innovation underscore test underscore night colon zero and then give it a name so for me it'll be test nights innovation and then give it a description as well so innovation underscore test underscore nights underscore d d e s c colon zero and then this is a test night innovation description all right so the last thing we need to be doing is typing in culture underscore parameter underscore unlock underscore test underscore night colon and then speech uh, can recruit square brackets get m a a so there's three capitals there capital g capital m capital a and then normal brackets single speech test underscore night then outside those brackets just the one bracket full stop capital G get name with capital N and then outside the square bracket as and then another square bracket men underscore at underscore arms and that's all there is to it uh, the whole mod is uh, done so we can launch and test and see what it looks like so I want to show my workflow uh, with uploading mods again uh, if you've already seen how I do this, you can skip ahead until I launch and see what it looks like. Yeah, anyway, so if we go to Upload Mod, and then we select our mod that we've been working on, and then go Steam Workshop, and then Upload here. Wait until that's downloaded. Once that is downloaded, uh, you can go back to your playsets, and then go to Workshop on Steam, whilst you've posted the mod that you have uploaded, unsubscribe from it, until that red triangle comes there remove from the playset, resubscribe, and add it to the playset. And then once that's done, you can click play. Once we've launched, we can click new game, select any age you like, and click on anywhere, create your own ruler, put in the test heritage or the culture that you've made, give it a name, and then test if that's working. So if you go to test, you can see here in the innovations, uh, the innovations is working you can hover over the name of test nights and it shows up with the stats and it can be uh, found out in trouble error so testing the traditions we can go into our culture have a look at our tradition and it, it seems like we can recruit our test nights through our tradition so that's awesome as a side note for everything in this video i wouldn't recommend putting the tradition with the innovation side of things so like this uh, as it can conflict and make it so that you can't recruit any of these uh, units that you've made but with that aside we can call that uh, the end of the tutorial um, if you have any questions about this tutorial uh, please let me know in the comments below uh, like the video if you like the video sub if you want to see more uh, tutorials and let me know if you have any tutorials you'd like to see in the future cheers